Oh, hi there, guys. I'm Casper Q. Felix, and so glad you could join me today. I'm going to be doing some fun science and calculus, and um, thought I might ask you if it, you, you're uh, differentiable. And what we're, go we're going to do is uh, get a graphing calculator and plot some graphs and make one of those parabolas and maybe a parabola too and we're gonna do it exponentially because you know algebra is fun as well so let's get down to business here Hi, I meant to make a clip about this a long time ago but I've been making these uh, aluminum skid plates for a long time make your board last a long time and it's nothing fancy it's just about a quarter inch or so thick give or take and made it out of a scrap off a piece of scrap uh, aluminum uh, that holds a computer monitor up a little frame and this stuff cuts real easy it's brittle and uh, these don't use a whole lot of power tools to rough the shape out of course it's not that thick e anyway to begin with but so you're just rounding those corners off so just hold it up to your board and trace it with a sharpie and then what I do is drill a few holes and uh, connect the dots with a hacksaw and uh, that's about it as far as roughing it out and then just pop a few holes in there for I'm using drywall one inch drywall screws and then just grind them down when you get it nice and tight and that's holding pretty good for now I've used like little 632 screws before with a nut on the other side and that works fine as well but uh, going this way this is working fine this time um, then I, I drill a few holes in it I use a pattern off of just a piece of scrap pegboard wood and uh, that's just for looks and and uh, I made one for the nose as well just to uh, you know it's, it doesn't get used as much but still sometimes you might be at a skate park or somewhere and uh, pull a Mr. Wilson where you fall backwards and the board shoots out like a rocket or slingshot and it can tag like a corner of a brick wall or concrete and splinter the crap out of the wood so that'll protect that from happening as bad and it gives you something to grab onto when you're holding your holding the nose like that put actually took the time to put some black paint on that which looks kind of cool I guess I didn't want to fool with it on the tail but and also this little thinner board this is an eight and a quarter board um, I like that width because it just feel better the faster I'm going and um, this is an old board that was my buddy's and it was a blank and uh, still is I guess but I repainted it white but this is the first board I built that has homemade rails from some plat, uh, scrap plastic I picked up off the road and I just traced them out with the sharpie again using this old rail it's probably old as Methuselah and then uh, cut them out with the bandsaw and popped holes with the handy drill press which comes in pretty handy so anyway that'll save your graphics even though this board doesn't have any graphics I still like using them and it gives you something again something to hold on to but old school I know but word to your mother trucker